that the, so that track you hear along with the music, I actually did that as a standalone piece, just the, the audio itself, for a, an art exhibit kind of critiquing, you know, the benefits, but also the, the shortcomings of the Americans with Disabilities Act. Uh, this was back in, uh, in, in 2015. And the producer of the exhibit, he just took me to a studio. I had all that stuff written out and just called a bunch of people up and everybody just took turns around a mic kind of acting and saying all that stuff. But yeah, those are all like, it really captures accurately to the tone, not just the words, but the the tone of all, you know, people with good intentions. But, uh, you know. Yeah, and I I think it's interesting (laughs) that you picked Can I Pray For You? Like, that's a really loaded question that's asked. Uh, to many different kinds of people, so I'm interested why you picked that one in particular. It, it's just the most visceral. It's like the hardest, like, you know, prayer is something that's it's really deep to them, but it's also super kind of just uncomfortable to me when somebody asks to do that, so I think that's just the one that, like, creates the most tension. Right, and, you know, you have this kind of angry, uh, well, definitely energetic uh, backing uh, with the with the band behind you, and it's improvisational jazz uh that's the foundation you picked here rather than some of your other songs on your album, which are more electronic in nature. So I'm curious why you picked that style for, for such a song. I mean, cause, cause deal, you know, it's really just because dealing with this stuff is, is improvisational. You know, I can walk the same path every day to the grocery store, to wherever, you know, to the train. And it's, you know, even if it's in my, so the place I've been living for this past three years, you know, I'm like I'm still gonna get, most likely have at least one, if not two to three of those asked, you know, and it's just it's always improvising how to deal with it. Should I be mad? Should I be? I haven't found out the answer, you know. So I'm just improvising in life. So I think that was the most fitting, and also just the energetic qualities of of that kind of style of groove. Well, great. Well, um, it'd be great if you could play another one. What are you gonna play next? Uh, yeah, we're going to do a tune off the record, uh, called Obevery. Uh, this one's, this one's a little bit different. This one's more about, uh, this one is dedicated to a really close friend of mine. And this is just kind of celebrating those really close friendships in your life. You know, you know, there's a lot of songs that celebrate like romance and stuff, but this is that kind of romance where it's just like, it's those friends who are always going to be there for you no matter what. You know, I know I have a number, uh, a number of them in this band here today. (laughs) 